something a little bit different today, heading to the Kulin Mountain, which is a big waterfall where a lot of locals go. Um, I'm in my private car with Connie over here. Hi. <laughs> and uh, because you can't get up here on the bikes that I have, and so you need a car, and it's pretty far out. So it's maybe an hour and a half, maybe a little bit more to get here. Uh, $20 entrance fee, so it's not gonna be a cheap day, but there's lots of cool stuff. Looking forward to get a little hike. Uh, there's the temples, waterfalls, all that jazz at the top. I'm on the road that they said you couldn't bring motorbikes on. Someone said that, but I definitely just passed a few. So a little bit of confusion. When we said hike, I thought it was through the woods. Um, it's a hike, it's just on a dirt road where some cars go. So I've already had a few people like slow down and a couple people took photos of me. I don't know where I'm gonna end up. Some other guy asked if I wanted a ride. <laughs> I think they're trying to make money, but still I'm like, no, I wanna walk. So I've got about two hours to go, woo! It was so nice, these guys just stopped asked to make sure I had water. That was awesome. So there have been some trails like that, right there, up and down the path. Um, I don't know where they go, but I'm not gonna take them because in this region I've read about in Vietnam and Cambodia, uh, there are still parks and areas where there are landmines. <laughs> Steering clear, staying right here on this road. There goes the popo. Just checking to make sure I'm okay. So, there are police out here. I'm pretty sure, oh my gosh, this is so intense. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I haven't stopped sweating in like three weeks. I think my body would be used to it. Maybe this wasn't such a great idea. Oh, <laughs> definitely jumping in that water. Oh my gosh, it is so humid here. <laughs> My friend was telling me about the sound. It's like straight out of a horror movie. What is that? I'm pretty sure these sounds mean, and this is where Lizzie on location was lost for the rest of her life. No signs of people. Well, I don't see any people, but signs that there's some people here. So. Not totally alone. Exciting news, it's 1209. There are cars coming at me. Why is that exciting? Because this is a one-way street. It starts one way up the mountain until 12. And then at 12, it's one way down the mountain. Um, so that means I've gotta be a nine minute drive. Whatever that isn't walking. Made it guys to the top. Another checkpoint, there's a lot of checkpoints. But it's a nice walk, it's just, really hot but shaded for most of the way so that helps anyway here at the top there's like markets and stuff and I'm heading towards the temple so I gotta put this on I guess I didn't read this part super carefully but more steps <laughs> made it to giant Buddha um, first of all, the views are really nice from up here, um, but Giant Buddha is right in there. He's really big. I didn't know what I was looking at. I thought it was just stone, but it's a very large Giant Buddha. He's just kind of like lounging. That's kind of what I feel like doing right now. waterfall but um, so far it's just a giant market lots of food so don't worry you'll find places to eat and trinkets but here water let's go check it out I'm still unclear as to what you can actually wear swimming if you can wear a bathing suit or not so we'll see hey here we are people having picnics all local And here we are. I don't know if you can see this over my shoulder. I'm going to shoot it as well. Uh, there's a rainbow there. Not much to the waterfalls. I think it goes down um, and you can see it better from there. But we are 
kind of small falls, but there's still people in it. Pretty. All right, this looks more like waterfalls. Okay, this is way better down here. That was super cool. So we were in there with all of those people um, and there are fish in there. I think you might have heard of them before. They get the massage and they like bite you. They don't bite hard, they like nip at you. So all of a sudden you'll be on your legs and you'll feel whoop, 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 like this and it's all the fish. Anyway, it's really cool. The water's super refreshing. Oh my gosh, did I need that. The only problem is um, I didn't bring a change of undergarments. So uh, I might be regretting this decision. We'll see.